In this guide, we'd like to give you a common instruction how to safely remove the hard drives from NAS device for data recovery. We advise you to read the manual for your device for more detailed information. Before we start, we power the device off pressing the power button. Then we wait some time until the system shuts down. After that, we unlock and open the casing. With the next step, we remove the hard drives one by one, lifting the ledge and then pulling the drives out of the bay. You should be careful in order not to damage the hard drives physically. Some NES models have labeled drive base corresponding to drive's label. Anyway, we recommend marking each drive to remind the order of the drives. An example of another NES model presupposes the same steps for taking the drives out of the casing, taking account some peculiarities of this model. In this model, drive bays are not hidden inside the box, but each of them is locked. To remove the drives, we should first unlock the NES casing with the key, certainly with the power off, and then lift the ledge and pull the drives. This NES model doesn't have drives labels, so in this case you should certainly mark the drives for further work. Discs in some NESs may be fixed more firmly. Please read the manual to your NES. When you need to remove the screws, try to do it carefully in order not to damage them. After removing the screws holding the disc, remove the disc. 